What's up, what's up, what's up? Be connect. How we doing? What's up, everybody? Welcome to the stream. Congratulations to Zando for getting first. Nobody does it like you, Zando. Nobody does it better. How are we doing, folks? Welcome in, welcome in. Happy that you're here, Pineapple. Happy that you're here, Zando. Happy that you're here, people watching the VOD later. Hello, all. Uh, folks, we've got a great night planned. We're going to be playing some Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. That was was voted upon by our Discord community over in our general chat. Um, if you would like to be a part of that, exclamation point Discord in the chat. Join the Discord. We'll be voting on these every single time we do a game together. We also vote on our Tuesday games. So we have opportunities, is what we're saying here. We're not a total democracy. We still pick our, I still pick Thursday games, but we're, we're nearly there. Gajban is almost empty. Almost. It would appear we have one, two, three, four. Four gotchas remaining, and then I'll just start writing down names. So we are very close. Rocking Ben right now, I'll have to do movie movie game later. You are all good, Zando. I rocked I rocked my baby to sleep tonight as well. Just open the gut shop on already so we can get back to training, Kakarot. Another Pokey badge. Still not the last one though. I think we still have more. Unamas, we're down to the last Poke badge. Still got one more. Whoa. This thing will go through. Congratulations, Zando. I'm getting the seventh Poke Badge there. Love to see it. Love to see it. Clean that bad boy out. Look, I mean, we're very, oh, you're doing it. Oh boy, okay. Zando's claiming the rest of them. We'll go ahead and pick a tier maker for me then. And I guess we'll just let Pineapple be the first of our restock list. All right, that is the other Poke Badge. So there's your tier maker. See what the remaining two are. First of the restock is Gacha King. I blew it. Watch it. Watch it happen, dude. Let's see. You got a Gamba. Hey, very cool. Okay. Gamba. All right. The last one is a die, but I got to get it out. What am I? Dosmas? Dosmas. How are we doing tonight, everybody? How's your Wednesday? How's hump day? Hump day. Zando, you might get to pick two games tonight. How does that feel? Or no, you get to pick a tier maker and a game. Uh, this is a 20-sided die, though. A D20. D20 is pretty tough. It's pretty tough. But it, stranger things have happened, okay? Give you a nice, honest roll here. And 11. And 11 and 11. Thank you for playing. All right. Let me write down that you got a tear maker. And then I'm going to start a gotcha list. Starting with Pineapple Pope. All right. Let me go ahead and spam that we're live over in general. All 
Rock on, dude. Rock on. Be back in a bit to do movie movie and suggest a tear maker. Sounds good, my friend. Thank you for being here. Thanks for hanging out. Did I ever update the go live? Please tell me I did. What does it say in the description of this video? I meant to update it, but I don't remember if I ever actually hit go. Is there a tier list of tier makers you've done? Nope. Nope. I got no clue. I, I have no idea. Genuinely no idea what I've done. You could give me something and I could act like it's the first time I've ever done it because I genuinely don't remember. In one ear, out the other. I guess I should start writing these down. Okay, good. I did get that out. So, the first thing that we're going to be doing tonight is going through Crossfire. If you're unfamiliar with Crossfire, let's see, I can shout them out. I imagine it's Crossfire Cast. Is it Crossfire Cast or Crossfire Podcast? Let's find out before I shout them out. Let's do that before I shout them out. It is Crossfire Podcast. Okay, glad I looked it up. Shout out to Crossfire Podcast. Great people over there, Dave and Russ. We love them. Friends of the community, friends of the church. We've worked together before. They put out a, it's not really weekly. I guess it's sort of weekly. They they try to do a, a very regular um, podcast called the Crossfire Podcast. Um, and this week's topic was 56 must play video games. And so I thought, well, that sounds like a fun opportunity for some content, some content. They went in alphabetical order. I'm going to rank them. I'm going to rank these 56 games by my own hot takes, um, excluding the ones that I've never played before, because there are a couple on there that are um, that are games I've not played. Um, but if I've even if I've even played it a little bit, I count it. But there are some games that I've genuinely not played at all on this list. So I figure the first thing we could do is go through the list, and then I'll rank them. Yeah, first look at them, then we'll rank them. So let's uh, let's let's give it a little let's give it a look, see them, and see what we're working with, and uh, see if you guys agree, disagree uh, with my order as I come up with them. So this is on my backlogged, and this is their list in alphabetical order. Now you will notice over here to the side that it says seventy-two games. They did give a list of fifty-six games. However, they gave a lot of games that were like sequels so like they recommended last of us and last of us 2 they recommended half-life and half-life alex they recommended technically there's even more than this because they did forza horizon 3 and 4 and 5 um there were several that they said like any from the franchise so there are a couple that are tricky on here i also did the new tomb raider i don't know which one they were i think they just said tomb raider franchise so i have no idea which one they were talking about um Again, here you go. Here's Super Mario. They did Super Mario or Super Mario World, so I put them both on there. So this is a little bit weird, but it is 72 games that I'm going to be ranking. But I'm going to be ranking all these games for pure quality and where I think they should go in order uh, because hashtag content. What's up, Perry? How we doing? This is the Crossfire Faith in Gaming's 56 must-play games. Now, I will say... Uh, in their podcast, this is the only hot take I'm going to give you guys. Dave and Russ, love you, mean it. I am going to give you a little bit of constructive criticism here. You wanted to touch on all of these touchstone games, these games that are like hallmarks of different play styles. Nary a monster collector. Not a single Pokemon in here. That's a big miss opportunity. Uh, and also, no visual novels. That's my hashtag hot take. Those are the two things that I like love more than anything. You did get a farming sim, so you, you get bonus points there. But the fact that we got Half-Life and Half-Life Alex, and we don't have a pocket man's is it hurts me deep inside. The fact that League is on here and not a pocket man's hurts me deep down, deep in my heart, in my heart of hearts. So that's where I'll end my rant. And we're gonna, we're gonna rank the rest of them by our own subjective opinion rather than what things didn't make the list or didn't make the cuts. Um, but those are those are my hot takes. Um, we're gonna rank them. So here comes the magic. I don't really know how I wanna do this necessarily, but we're just gonna, maybe we're gonna find, should I find the games I haven't played probably first? What games have I not played? I haven't played Deus Ex. 
We'll take that one right down to the end because I've never played it before. Um, ba -ba 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 what else have I never played? Thief, I've never played. Um, I've never played Last of Us Part Two. Uh, Starcraft, I've never played. Um, that might be Road Rash. I've never played. Um, I think that was it. Oh no, I've never played Half Life. I never played Half Life or Half Life Alex, but I wrote them on my backlog. I guess I'll put them down there as well. Do, 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 do. Hello, Splash. What's up, Splash? How we doing, my friend? Welcome in. Okay, so now that we have those out of the way, I just want to make sure that's all of them. I guess I should start dragging. I don't know how I'm going to do this because there's so many good games. That's the really tricky part is there's just so many good ones on here that it's going to be really tricky to figure out which ones are my favorite. Um, I can go ahead and say like the worst ones. Let's let's put the ones that I don't enjoy or don't think are actually that good. Um, Angry Birds, overhyped. Really, really just a fun mobile game that wasn't even the best mobile game. We'll put that one down at the bottom uh, for now. Uh, let's see, what else? Candy Crush was honestly more fun than uh, than Angry Birds, but not much more. Um, I can't go, I'm gonna put it on the bottom for now. It probably won't stay on the very bottom uh, because it's not that bad of a game. It's nowhere near as bad as Angry Birds. Uh, let's see. What else is not that great? Not that great of a game. Uh, ba -ba 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 All these games are pretty great. Pretty great. I can't even knock League, dude. League's actually a pretty great game, you know? Uh, Crash doesn't hold up that well anymore. It's pretty good, but with the, with a list this good, you're going to have to start putting some good games on the bottom. Um, let's see. I don't think Microsoft, Microsoft Flight Simulator is going to be able to hold up. Um, it's not that it's a bad game, but in this in this league, there ain't no way. There just ain't no way. Ba -ba 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 -ba. PUBG's a bad game. By the way, I just randomly picked Season 6. Let's see. Gosh, this is going to be so hard. This is going to be so difficult! Oh, man, dude. Look, I love Wii Sports, but it can't be up this high. We'll put it down at the bottom, too. Tomb Raider's probably going to be down the bottom. THPS is going to be down the bottom. Bejeweled is honestly worse than Candy Crush. I like Candy Crush more than Bejeweled, if I'm being totally, totally upfront. Spyro's got to be down there with Crash. Uh, man. What are other bad games? Okay, honestly, I think we've got our bottom, I think we've got our bottom tier pretty good. So Angry Birds, I think, is probably the worst on here. Bejeweled, Candy Crush... Can I ask a dumb question? Why 56 games? I do not know. That would be a question you have to ask them. If I had to make an assumption, I would presume SEO. Uh, let's see. PUBG is worse than Flight Simulator. Wii Sports is better than Tomb Raider. Wii Sports is better than Splinter Cell. I don't know. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay. So now we got to start thinking, what's better than Gran Turismo? What's better than Gran Turismo, but not the rest of them? I'm honestly thinking SimCity might be a good option. And probably Civ, too. I'll probably bring Civ down here. Those RTS games are just all right. Um, no Fire Emblem on here, either. My dudes! You're killing me. Yeah, all the RTSs are going to be down here. They just don't hold up. Man. They simply don't hold up against the competition. They have such a they have such a, a limit to their playability. 
Um, not much Nintendo love. No, they're PlayStation peeps. They're PlayStation peeps. Miss Pac-Man, I guess we'll go down there. It's a, it's an icon, but hey, look, please tell me if you play more than like 30 minutes of Miss Pac-Man. Please. Indulge me. Tetris is real good, though. Oof. If you play, if you can sit in one setting and play more than 30 minutes of Ms. Pac-Man, either you're lying or you're in your 50s. Ooh, that was mean. <laughs> that was meaner than I meant it to be. All the love, all the love to our aged gamers. Uh, pro probably, probably, probably down here as well. I love Mortal Kombat, but... I'm probably going to take Street Fighter down there, too. Again, these are just games. just They're not that replayable. Let's see. Oh, man. This is really tough. Now, this is getting real hard. Real challenging. I guess now let's work the other way. No, you know, I'm going to take Grim Fandango right down there. It's a good story game, but... When, when put up against these, I just don't know. Super Mario Bros. Definitely got to go down here. I would say Super Mario Bros. is worse than Tetris. Hmm. Oh, I've never played Gone Home either. That's another one. It's been on my backlog forever. Maybe now we need to start dragging some to the top. Start working our way up now. Um, some games, some games that are absolutely my top tier games would have to be probably Inside is up there pretty high. Journey's up there pretty high. Uh, Ocarina's up there pretty high. Uh, again, they didn't put, they just put Smash Franchise. That's another tricky one. Hades up there pretty high. So I just put I just put Smash in 64. Breath of the Wild's up there, pretty high. Mario Galaxy, pretty high. MK8, pretty high. Life is Strange, pretty high. Oh, Portal and Portal 2, pretty high. Portal 2, higher than Portal. Um, Minecraft, pretty high. Ooh, Rocket League can go down here. That's a good one. It's a good one that's not too good. Hard to deny, hard to deny Banjo, even if it doesn't hold up quite as well. Hard to deny it, hard to deny Stardew. Stardew's gotta go way up here. <laughs> Smash is pretty great. Creeper down Banjo for now. Sims is gonna go up here to Banjo for now. Uh, I really like Stanley, I really like Animal Crossing. Last of Us is an icon. Shadow's an icon. Man, they picked some great games. They really picked some great games. Yes, but two specific Zeldas. Elden Ring's pretty good. Okay, okay. I'm feeling like we're getting something to work with now. Uh, let's see. Bloodborne versus World of Warcraft. World of Warcraft has got to be over it. Skyrim is over World of Warcraft. Resident Evil is over Skyrim. RDR is below Skyrim. RDR 2 is over RE4. Fortnite. Fortnite. It's an icon. Again, it's a pretty big deal. But honestly, I'm going to say just above World of Warcraft for me. Sonic the Hedgehog is pretty great. League is going to be below, below, below. Yeah, right there. Uh, Sonic versus KOTOR. Gosh. I don't know. Let's, let's take Forza down below. Probably below Skyrim. Doom below four is uh no keep on dropping it keep on dropping it keep on dropping it right there is good. Mm, yeah, right there. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. We're getting into some tricky tricky categories. Dark Souls has got to be below, but Bloodborne probably below Rocket League, honestly. Now we're getting into some really, really challenging stuff here. What is better than... I'm going to say Sonic's probably better than KOTOR. 
Halo's better, or KOTOR's better than Halo. Ugh, woof. This is getting into some tough category. I'm gonna say Castlevania's right about neck and neck. KOTOR. Bioshock is, is really right around God of War. I'm gonna say it's better than GTA V, worse than God of War. Star Wars is just around, I'm gonna say KOTOR is better than, nah, I don't know, I like the Lego games more than KOTOR. Bloodborne would be higher for me if it wasn't capped at 30 FPS. I've heard really, so Bloodborne is one that I, I have it on here as I've played it, but in truth, I've watched Bloodborne. I've watched it more than played it. Okay. See, now we're getting some more things to work with here. Some more, some lower tiered games to work with. Um, Stanley Parable is a really good story, but I don't know if it's as good a story as Bioshock. some tough, tough categories. I know Hades is better than Elden Ring, but I don't know if it's better than SMW. Sims is probably not better than SMW. But it's my ranking, and I really liked the first Sims. I'm going to put it just above SMW. Animal Crossing, just above that. Smash. Smash is better than Banjo. Cart's better than Smash. Mm, Portal. I'm going I'm to drop Portal 1 down a little bit. Portal 1's probably going to go down below Bioshock. Portal 2 will stay right above Last of Us. Oh, God. Galaxy. Galaxy's going to go down here below SMW and Hades. Yeah, I'm really dropping it pretty far. Oof. Man, Galaxy. How the how the mighty have fallen, huh? Uh, let's see. We're getting we're getting good. We're getting good. We're getting to the we're getting to the good part. Inside, I'm going to say is just a little worse than Shadow of the Colossus, but definitely up there with the ex excellent storytelling. Um I feel like Journey's too high. I'm going to put Journey right down there with Inside. I'm going to say Inside's better than Journey for now. Dar uh, Bloodborne is what got me into Dark Souls. I started with DS3 and didn't really like it at first, but after playing Bloodborne, everything clicked. I feel like a lot of people, Bloodborne is their favorite. I'm going to put Minecraft right above Banjo. I think I'm feeling pretty good about this, honestly, you guys. So, Zando, Crossfire, Faith Plus Gaming, our good friends Dave and Russ, put together 56 must-play games. However, it is a little longer than 56 games because they also included some sequels, and they gave some that were like a 3D platformer, and then they listed like four. Um, and so I just put everything that they mentioned on their list, and they didn't rank them. They, did, they, didn't, uh, they didn't have the guts. They just put them in alphabetical order, but I'm ranking them. So I took their 72 games and I've ranked them with the exception of Deus Ex to Gone Home, which I have not played. So this is this is my list. And honestly, I'm gonna I'm gonna go through it right now just to make sure that I like it. I'm gonna go ahead and save changes just to make sure we don't lose all this. This is being saved. Try refreshing in a few seconds. I'll try in precisely 10 seconds. One, two, three, four. Or just enough time to get the movie game out. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's see what it is. What's it gonna be? Okay, movie, movie game, Zando. A posh cocker spaniel shares Italian food and kisses with George, Lizzie, and Ralph, three gigantic city-destroying mutant animals that must be stopped. A posh cocker spaniel shares Italian food and kisses. Yep, you got it immediately, man. I didn't have to read it a second time. Lady in the Tramp Age, so good, so good. All right, let's refresh, just make sure. Cool, all right, all right, we're gonna go through it again, just to make sure that I feel confident in all of these choices, okay? 
So this is going to be how I'm going to do this. I'm going to read through one at a time and make sure that I agree with my decisions. Stardew is better than Life is Strange. I think so. Life is Strange, better than Breath of the Wild. That's a toughie, but I'm going to go with it for now. Breath of the Wild, better than Ocarina of Time. That's really hard for me to say, really hard for me to swallow, but I think I believe that. Ocarina of Time, better than Mario Kart 8. Yeah, MK8, better than Super Smash, the in general. Uh, Smash is better than Minecraft. Minecraft, better than Banjo. Banjo, better than Portal 2. Ooh, I might have to drop Banjo. That's a little too high praise. Nah, I, don't, I can't keep Banjo here. Banjo's a great game, but it ain't that good. Banjo's better than Inside. Okay. Minecraft's better than Portal 2. Okay, Portal 2, better than Last of Us. Last of Us, better than Shadow of the Colossus. I don't know if I agree with that either, man. I really like Last of Us, but Shadow of the Colossus was such an important game. I definitely like the play style of Shadow almost all around. Ah, that hurts. Okay, Shadow of the Glosses is better than Last of Us. Last of Us is better than Banjo. Banjo is better than Inside. Inside is better than Journey. Journey is better than Animal Crossing. Do I agree with that? Better than Animal Crossing in general? Yeah, yes. Animal Crossing, better than Sims. Sims, better than SMW. Ah. Yeah, I... And so here's the problem. Here is the problem with SMW for me is that I definitely did not play it as often as I did the Sims. So I'm going off nostalgia factor here. SMW better than Hades? Just barely. Hades better than Elden Ring? Definitely. Elden Ring better than FF... Is that FF8? No, it's supposed to be FF7. Oopsie doopsie. Oopsie doopsie. Hang on. Remember that. Remember this. Remember FF7 is right below Elden Ring. Could have sworn I did seven. Oh, did it go all the way to the bottom? Let's say that isn't cloud. Okay. So the problem is that six is better than every other and eight is better. <laughs> yeah, they, they said seven, man. And I don't know about that, but seven is good. Seven is good. I think 10 is the best personally, but of course I'm a PlayStation two kid. Uh, seven is better than God of War. It's really hard to say. It's, that's a that's a difficult sentence. God of War is better than Bioshock. I can agree with that. Bioshock better than Portal? I think so. Portal better than Stanley? Definitely. Stanley better than SM uh, Galaxy? Mm -hmm. Galaxy better than GTA 5? Yes. Uh, I've heard great stuff about FF6. I think, Perry, I think you would love FF6. I think you would just enjoy yourself with it. Grand Theft Auto 5 better than Sonic the Hedgehog 2? I don't know. I don't know about that. GTA is fine, dude. I'm going to drop GTA down below, KOTOR. Yeah. Galaxy better than Sonic 2. Sonic 2 better than Castlevania. Symphony. That's a tough one, too, but I'm going to go with it. And no Metroid on here, dude. Not a single Metroid. Just a Metroidvania and Castlevania is the one they picked. Castlevania better than Star Wars. Video game Lego. They actually just said any Lego game. I picked Lego Star Wars the video game because I just think it's kind of the, the, the epitome of the franchise. Lego Star Wars better than KOTOR. Yes. KOTOR better than GTA 5? Yes. GTA 5 better than Halo Combat Evolved? Yes. Definitely not true. I gotta, I gotta bump RDR up. Uh, we're gonna put it, we're gonna put it above GTA. Okay. RDR better than GTA? Yes. GTA better than Halo? Yes. Halo better than Resident Evil? No. Resident Evil back up, bumping bump, 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 bump back up. Uh, Halo better than Skyrim? No. Skyrim, bump it up. Halo better than Forza? Yes. Now we're getting somewhere. Forza better than RDR 1? Yes. RDR 1 better than Fortnite? Definitely. Fortnite better than World of Warcraft. I don't know if I agree with myself there anymore. I'm gonna bump, I'm gonna bump World of Warcraft up a little bit. Fortnite better than Bloodborne. Gotta disagree. <laughs> Fortnite better than Rocket League. Okay. Still no. Rocket League better than Fortnite. Fortnite better than Dark Souls. Yes. Dark Souls better than League. Agreed. League better than Tetris. Disagree. League better than Super Mario Bros. Disagree. League better than Doom. Okay. Doom better than Grim Fandango. I feel bad for Grim Fandango, but it just hasn't held up. I'm sorry, Lucas. I'm sorry. League is a good game. It's just such a toxic community. Grim Fandango better than Street Fighter 2. I don't think I agree with that anymore. I'm going to bump Street Fighter back up. Probably above League. Uh, let's see. Grim better than Mortal Kombat. I still don't think I can agree there either. I'm going to bump both those up. I do think Street Fighter 2 is better than Mortal Kombat, even though I like Mortal Kombat better. Uh, Miss Pac-Man, yes. Okay, Grim Fandango better than Miss Pac-Man, yes. Miss Pac-Man better than Roller Coaster Tycoon. I don't think so anymore. I'm going to bump that up. Uh, Miss Pac-Man better than SimCity. Ooh, I don't think so. SimCity bumps back up. Miss Pac-Man better than Gran Turismo. 
I don't know, probably. Uh, Gran Turismo better than THPS? No, THPS is moving up. Nope, moving on up. Uh, Gran Turismo better than Splinter Cell? Probably. Splinter Cell better than Tomb Raider? Probably not. Splinter Cell better than Microsoft Flight Simulator? Yes. Better than PUBG? Yes. Spyro, that's, I'm doing my, I'm doing Spyro dirty. Spyro's gonna move up to Wii Sports level. Uh, probably the same with Crash. I do think Crash played better than Spyro. Uh, okay. Wii, Crash, Spyro, Gran, Tomb's gonna go above Gran Turismo as well. Tomb, Grand, Splinter, Microsoft Flight Simulator, PUBG. PUBG. PUBG's honestly worse than Candy Crush. Bejeweled, yep, still, and then Angry Birds. Boom, that's the list. I've done it. By golly, I've done it. I haven't played Deus Ex to Gone Home. Disregard. Disregard. Boom, baby. View that list. View that beautiful, beautiful list. I've done it. No Link to the Past or Super Metroid is a crime which cannot be, be forgiven. I don't know if you noticed, but there's also no Pocket Mans. No Pokemon on here. Um, but you can go take that up with them in their Discord or on their podcast page or on their website. But here is my ranking of their 56 must-play games. Now, if I were to make a 56 must-play games, my list would look very different. But this is the 56 that they picked. And you know what? That's just that's just what it is. <laughs> it is what it is. They did a wonderful job putting together a list, and I appreciate them doing uh, putting the effort there. Um, and I'm proud of my list. I'm proud of this. I agree with it. I stand by it. I hold strong. I hold these truths to be self-evident. I feel good about it. Honestly, GTA 5 is still up a little high. Still up a little high. My suggested tier maker got lost in the mix. Here you go. Stardew Valley NPC tier list. Okay. Uh-oh. Hang on, I'm gonna turn off just to make sure we don't get spam with ads real fast. We can do this quick. We can do it quick, why not? Why not do it now? We can do it real quick, real fast. And then we'll and then we'll get into some Mario Kart. This shouldn't take long at all. Shouldn't take long at all. We'll even keep the uh, SABCD. Okay, here we go. Uh, we're just gonna leave the ads up. Uh, building brighter future futures with Red Nose Day. I support Red Nose Days. That sounds great. Okay, <clears throat> Abigail. I do love Abigail, mm. but she's not my waifu for laifu. She's great, but she's not my waifu for laifu. I'm gonna give Abigail a solid A. I like that she plays the flute. Alex, eh, eh. I'll give him a C. Average. The mysterious man is his name Key or something? No, that's Key. Who is this? Who is this? Who is this man? That's Key. Who is that? We'll skip for now. Caroline, uh, I never really got to know Caroline, but I do like that she has green hair. She's better than Alex. That's objectively true, so B. Uh, Clint, not a fan. Not a fan, not a fan of Clint. Uh, not a fan of his quests. Um, he seems real sad to me. And I want to um, be his friend. I want to encourage him as a person. Um, it is my code, my code. I will be, and I'll, I'll, I'll be live, so we should see to be able to join my code and everything in just a momento. Uh, Clint, we're gonna... We're gonna bump Alex down. We're gonna bump Alex down to D. We're gonna throw him over here. Or Demetrius. Demetrius seems like a great guy, you know. I think he's gotta be a swell person. I don't really know him that well. He just seems like a swell person. We're gonna give him a solid C. Um, this is the uh, the 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 dwarf gnome gnome dwarf dwarven language, I think. Um, they're nice. They're kind. They sometimes try to swindle me on things, but they're there. I like. I think they're cute. They look like little Jawas. Friend of the, I'm a fan of their design. I'm gonna give him a solid B. Uh, Elliot, um, I like that Elliot is the artist, the sensitive type. However, I have never romanced him. Um, he's, he just seems fine to me. He's very Fabio-esque, which is fine. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna say he's pretty average as well. Give him a solid C. Uh, what's her name? I can't remember her name. Hmm. That's pro that's probably not good if I can't remember her name. Give him a solid C. Granny, Granny's great. Granny's great. I'm gonna give her a B. Uh, this is a grumpy, grumpy Gus. Emily, Emily is her name. Yes, yes, yes. Um, I do like that she has blue hair. So honestly, I should probably put it up with Caroline because they have colored hair and I like the colored hair, but nope. 
Uh, Grumpy Gus here is... Um, I like that he likes hot peppers. It makes me want to be his friend because I also like hot peppers. However, I kind of feel the same about him as I do about Clint. They're just grumpy. They're just grumpy. C tier. Doing Emily dirty? Y'all are fans of Emily? Are we Emily fans up in here? Do you guys want me to bump up Emily? Okay, I don't know who this is. Uh, that's the mayor. The mayor uh, never likes my soup. D tier. Doesn't like my soup. Not a fan of him. Uh, Grandpa's ghost. I mean, he's grandpa. He's grandpa. What are you going to do? S tier. Uh, this is the museum keeper and the museum keeper is fine. Oh, that is totally the adventurers guild guy. Yes, yes, yes. I like, I like him. I like him enough. We'll put him on C tier. Uh, the museum keep guy. I don't know, man. Uh, He's fine. He's fine. I like his style. I like his swagger. He reminds me of the bad guy from Wild Wild West. He's a good design. I'm going to give him a B. Uh, Gus. Gus is swell. Gus is swell. He helps out. Um, he helps out our boy Linus whenever he's hungry. Gus. Good guy, Gus. Good guy, Gus. Good guy, Gus. Gets uh, an A. Uh, Haley. Haley was my first wife. She was my very first one that I ever romanced. Uh, I never romanced her again, but I thought she was pretty, and I liked that she liked coconuts, because I also really like coconut. That's a thing about me, and I looked up the gift list, and I learned. Tony Lotus is a madman. I don't fear that. Got mad weapons, too. Ain't trying to hear that. Love it. Lotus. Uh, yeah, but she was my, she's my first wife. I can't not. I mean, she's my first wife. My very first one? Come on, S tier. Uh, obviously, Harvey S tier. What are we talking about? We don't need to talk about that one. I don't know who this goblin guy is. Is he in a new update? I've never seen him before. Children, I feel I feel weird rating children. I feel like I can't rate children. She's the one that jumps rope, and that makes me happy for her. Good for her. Good job, C tier. Um, Joe? Joe is her name, I think? He's the witch's assistant. Yeah, I've never gotten to the witch. I've never gotten to the witch. Is the witch here? Am I overlooking the witch? I would like to get to the witch, but I always burn out before I get there. Uh, Joe, Joe, and Kent are they the are they the ones that are married? And Kent got back from war or whatever. That sounds familiar. I think that's this family. Um, I feel kind of bad for Joe because her husband just came back from war and is clearly traumatized, uh, and that's fun canon. So we're gonna give her we're gonna give her a. I'm gonna be your friend. I'm gonna be your friend. Uh, yeah, C tier. I'm gonna be your friend. Kind of like Clint. I don't know them that well, but I want to be friends with them. I'd like to get to know them better and work them up to a B, but they're not there yet. They're just not there yet. Uh, the Goblin, I do not know who. I don't know either of these people yet, so I don't know. I don't know if I'm able to go, give them an adequate rating. You know, I never have gotten to try. I've never tried to get to know him. He makes me very sad, and I think he needs a hug. I'm giving him C tier. That's my hug for him. Krobus, S tier. What are we talking about? Come on. Uh, Leah S tier. What are we talking about? Uh, the, you know what? I don't know. I don't know, dude. Lewis, dude. Lewis is a piece of work, okay? Lewis is a piece of work. He helps us. He has a vision for the town. But I feel like a lot of it was on my back. And not a lot of it was on his back. I think that is the bouncer for Keith. Maybe that's what it is. Um, Lewis could have done more, dude. Lewis could have done more for me, man. He could have done more for me and he never did. C tier. Uh, Linus is a real sweetheart, giving him an A tier. Uh, this is the other Adventurer's Guild guy. I'm going to bump this Adventurer's Guild guy up to up to B, and I'm going to keep him on C. Yeah. I feel good about that. I feel good about that. Marnie. Lewis is also a real weirdo. Yeah, the statue is real weird. The underwear is real weird. Yeah, yeah. Don't like Lewis. Don't trust him. Not sure about him. Um, Marnie. Um, Marnie frustrates the tar out of me. So I'm putting Marnie in D tier and for one reason alone, because if if she would keep to a consistent schedule, okay, then my animals wouldn't starve, all right? But she doesn't. And so whenever you're in that first year and you don't have a silo yet and all you need is some hay to feed your chickens and she's just not ever there, D tier. Maru, Haru, Maru, Haru, Maru. I don't know Maru. I've never gotten to know her. Um, I mean, come on. 
Do we need to do we need to talk about him? We don't. Key is mysterious and blue. And mysterious and blue people are canonically cool. So we're gonna give him a B tier. Um, Pam. Maru was your first waifu. How about that? I I've never got to know her. Never got to know her. Uh, Pam, she drives a bus. She drives a bus. She drives a bus, and and I think that I think that we would get along. She is a piece of work, but I think that she's the kind of piece of work that would work at my like great clips and would cut my hair and we would get along. I think Pam would go to my church. Is what I'm saying. I think Pam goes to a rural United Methodist church. And that that makes me kind of like her in a weird way. I'm gonna give her a, I'm gonna give her a B. Um, Penny Penny is wonderful. Same feelings as Abigail. They're, that's that's kind of my like. I might I might choose to to wipe through them. I might not. Uh, Pierre, I feel bad for Pierre. Pierre gets pity points. I'd probably put him at a C, but I'm gonna give him a B because of pity points. Robin, Robin. Pierre's a punk. You're not a fan of Pierre? I, I I feel bad for Pierre because he's really just trying his best. Trying to make ends meet. He's trying to let capitalism win in this town, and he just can't make it work. You guys don't like Pierre. Do I need to drop Pierre down a tier? What are our what are our hot takes on Pierre? Why are we not a fan? I always wanted Robin to be romanceable, but I never wanted her to divorce from Demetrius, and so I always felt weird about that. And I know there was a mod out there where you could um, do a divorce for them, and that made me really sad for, for Robin. And I feel guilty about even wanting to look into that. But I did always want to romance her. I'd bump him down, I'll do it. He's all grassroots until his competition is gone and then he turns into a butt. Interesting, interesting, I'll bump him down to see. Uh, I like Robin, I like Robin's character. I like how she tells lame jokes. She's fun, she's fun. Um, I never got to know him. I don't even know his name. Don't even know his name. Sam. Never even got to know his name. Do not know him. Cannot adequately weigh in on him. Uh, Mermaid Lady, I think her name is Sandy. It does look a lot like Rod Stewart. Or it looks like Gohan. Gohan, uh, adult Gohan Super Sam. Um, Sandy's fine. Sandy's confident. Sandy, Sandy ain't playing any games, okay? And I think that I gotta respect, I gotta respect a uh, hashtag girl boss who knows what she wants in life. And so Sandy, Sandy is gonna be a B. I would also romance Sandy if she were an option. Uh, what's his name? I know this is Shane. I don't remember his name. Again with the children, the children are gonna go on the same tier because I feel uncomfortable ranking children. Um, Willie, Willie. I don't like fishing. For those of you that don't know, I'm not a fan of fishing. And uh, and uh, Willie really likes fishing. I don't even like fish. I don't like the smell of fish. I don't like being around fish. I like being on the ocean, but I don't really like being out in the water. Not a fan. Don't like boats. Don't like anything to do with boats. And so personally, even though I enjoy the fishing in the game, I don't enjoy fishing IRL. But Willie is very generous. He gives us fishing rods so early. Generosity is going to keep him at a C tier, but honestly, I'd put him in a D tier because of how much I hate fishing. Wizard is obvious S tier. I'd marry him if I could. Uh, Shane, Shane is all of us, you know? <laughs> Shane, Shane streams on Twitch is what I'm saying. Shane is, is sad all day until he gets off work and goes and streams on Twitch. You know what I'm saying? And I just, my heart breaks for Shane. So I'm gonna give him a B tier. I hope he makes it out of there. Sebastian, I do not know. These four people, I do not know. I'm gonna add a, I'm gonna add a, never got to know him. Add a row below. And I'm gonna call this the strangers. Stranger. Stranger. Stranger danger. Don't know them. Don't know them, probably never will. There you go. There's my tier list. This is how it goes. I feel good. I feel confident about this. Um, and I think that we've got, I think we've got a solid chart. We've got a solid chart. So I'll download this image and I will put it on our uh, Discord, exclamation point Discord in the chat. And you guys can participate as well in that tier maker. Boom. Bada bing, bada boom. I'm gonna also save it onto my bookmark bar. 
so that I can um, post. Harvey? Come on, Harvey? Harvey, Harvey, Harvey the Wonder Hamster. He doesn't bite and he doesn't squeal. He just runs around on his hamster wheel. Harvey, Harvey, Harvey the Wonder Hamster. Hey, Harvey. Harvey looks exactly like my brother-in-law, which made it super weird when Sarah played and married him. Oh no. Weird Al deep cut, dude. All right, let's see if I can even get this game to boot. I'm pretty sure it's I'm pretty sure it's Nate Dub. I'm like 99% sure it's Nate Dub. Folks, if you want to play along, exclamation point friend? Is it exclamation point friend maybe? Is it maybe exclamation point friend? That's it. I'm pretty sure that's my friend code. I guess I'm going to pause Spoofy. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and make a room. You sent a friend request my way? Do, do, do. do you mind me showing your name on screen? Maybe I'll, maybe I'll just... Maybe I'll just... Oh, well, I actually can't because it's the only way I can see it. I'm so sorry. I hope this is okay. It doesn't show your, your friend code or anything, right? Okay. Become friends. Nice. Meow. All right. I had to cancel NSO auto renewal because of my lack of dollars, so I can only pay online until 1023. Oh my goodness, so you got to get it in now. You got to get in right now. Uh, folks, you may notice down at the bottom of your um, of your channel points that we have a new reward called Race Gamba. If you are interested in gambling on a particular race, then you let me know, and uh, the rules will be if I place in the top three or not. So that'll be the Gamba. Does Nerf Astronaut place in the top three? Yes or no? That's the Gamba. Now, as long as we only have uh, one or two people playing, obviously that's not gonna that's not gonna work. But assuming that we don't have enough people playing tonight, we will um, we'll improvise. We'll play some other other. We'll play some real people, some real online people that I don't know. Not you fake people that I do know. Oh my goodness. I can't wait. I cannot wait to read Chris W's lengthy dissertation on the Go Retroid Pocket. Xano and Pineapple Brots. I knew it, dude. Pineapple, are you seeing me, my friend? Are you able to join? Same goes for you, Zando. I assume it is just us three, because Perry doesn't have the game. And I don't know if anybody else is joining us tonight. I haven't heard from anybody. What's up, Reverend Taco? How we doing, my friend? Do you own Mario Kart? You want to play some Mario? I believe you need online, yes. I think so. Yep, I think you will need an online account. They probably have a free trial. You have Mario Kart? Do you have online play? If you want to play, send me a friend request so we can play some Mario. Play some Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. It'll be a sec. All right. That's fine with me. I'm a little nervous, says Zando. Oh no, Zando, don't be nervous. All right, I'm gonna hop in our secret room for anybody that wants to hop in. Doop, 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 doop. Don't feel that you have to, but if you're just wanting to chat and you have filled out a form, then there you go. 
My switch is dead. No! I'm sorry, Reverend Taco. Sando, I should be able to hear you. Yeah, I'm here. Perfect. I was just waiting for an opportune time. I just wanted to make sure I could hear you. Well, Reverend Taco, we're playing until uh, 10 o'clock. So you got time. Charge that bad boy up if you're feeling like playing. Join in. Join in on the fun. One last, one last hurrah before you travel. Are you using tilt controls, Zando? Sure enough. No, I just. You just wanted to say it. Yeah. You're just new boot goofing over there. I think we have to wait for more players. It's okay. No, I'd rather watch tonight. You're all good, Reverend Taco. Just know the hand is extended. Is that pineapple vote? Is that all three of us? Does it not display their names when they get here? You just need to know exactly what your me friends look like. Yes. Yes. Well, pineapple just added me as a friend. I couldn't have known. His head is a literal pineapple. Uh, that should have been what gave it away. Do we want comms? I think so. Let's do comms. I'm going to do normal comms. And that way we can potentially do gambas because we can throw on comms. That'll be perfect. Um, 48 races sound good with everybody. <laughs> All right, we got four. Here we go. We'll start with four. See if anybody else hops in. Oh, I need to change our category too. Was everybody good with uh, 150cc? I probably should have asked. I'm good with it. I have not played any of the new stuff. so I have played all of them. Well, I'm going to need to go transparent, aren't I? Because we're going to be able to need to see. What's up? I'm going to drop myself down to 72. Feels pretty good. Yeah, nice. How we doing, trombone? How's life treating you? Hopefully all good. Ooh, I'm very transparent. I look like a ghost. Spooky's Gary. It's almost spooky season. Ooh, my delay is not that off. That is not usual for me. Am I such a welcome? We've missed you, Trombone. You've been busy with work. Been busy with work and car stuff. Had a rough go of it. I don't hear it, but I do believe you. You know what? You're turned down incredibly low. I bet no one can hear you. Just realized that. In between this race and the next one, I need to turn back up desktop audio. He's soft but audible. That is surprising because it is turned down so low. But audible, I think, was what I was described as in my high school yearbook. <laughs> oh, right into a banana. <laughs> my own shell. Man. I'm not a fan of when that happens. Life is something. I decided today to accept insurance settlement offer. Can't find my extra set of car keys. Rental ends tomorrow. Still trying to figure out next steps and look at my options. I am so sorry. That is so frustrating. Yeah, Zando's superlatives were soft but audible and the other one. This too shall pass. This too shall pass, Trombone. 
Received an amazing financial blessing from Methodist Gaming today that actually brought me to my knees. That's fantastic. I was actually just listening to their podcast with uh, Rethink UMC. I'm going to post it on the Discord tomorrow. Great listen. Also friends of the show. Friends of the stream. We've now ranted and raved about both Methodist Gaming and Crossfire. It's a regular Methodist fest. I was going to call it a meth fest, but then I realized that would probably not be the same thing. All right. Cranking you up, Zando. I can also move the microphone closer and speak a little bit louder if that's helpful. Hashtag meth fest. Let's not get that trending. Let's do the opposite of trend. I'm going to bump myself up to 80. So loud, way too loud. You want me to bump it back down? I'll go down. I'll go down by six. Let's see if that helps. I try to get everybody at that sweet spot of negative 10 to negative five. I try. Nice. Hooray. I don't know how to add them anymore. I'm just an ineffective mod. I don't know why that wouldn't work. Yeah, negative six. If I could get it to precisely go to negative six, I certainly would. But I, I normally just try to shoot for negative ten and negative five, and just assume that it's gonna that it's gonna zone in around there. I just keep getting got by my own stuff. I'm not doing score. The fact that I'm in third is truly amazing. Cat Dapper Pastor reached out to me about being the recipient of his streams past the cap this month, which was another unexpected blessing because any amount is helpful at this point. That's wonderful. Really cool. uh, Flat Cap seems like a super cool guy. No, no! Oh, nice. I was gonna say waste of a star, but then I narrowly avoided that lightning. Bolt. Yeah, Amazed I got third. I think that's a super cool thing that he's got set up. That passed the cap.
folks who are just now joining us in the chat, I know we've got a couple of new folks hopping in. If you want to play some more real quick, feel free. Exclamation point friend is my friend code. You can add me in there. We're in a friend's private room. We'll be able to join us in there. Love to have you. Bowser just did you dirty, huh? Yeah. Uh, Honestly, at this point, I'm just, I'm getting used to it. My students aren't going to be happy tomorrow when they have assigned seats because their behavior is out of control. I never mind assigned seats when I was in school too much. Because I knew what I was going to be doing anyway. I was going to be sitting in my seat. Be doing. Regardless of who I was sitting next to. I was always going to be doing. Yikes! Whoopsie. So I with another teacher for a few minutes during lunch today because I couldn't process and deal with one class, specifically Wednesday. That's rough. I can't imagine. I could not do it. I don't know how my life does it. Could not do the teaching thing. Did I get you, Zando? You did. <laughs> I wanted to get Bowser. Yeah, I got a lot of really poorly timed hits in this <laughs> this match, including a lightning bolt right at the end. Man, that green shell though wasn't even meant for you. Twist of the knife. Turn of the screw. Now we've done Paris. What shall we do next? I was screening my last class today and went and spoke to admin for suggestions because it is difficult to stay in your seat, do your work, and keep hands, feet, and other objects to yourself. I'm telling you, I couldn't. I couldn't possibly. Can't imagine. Is this last race or is there one more? Uh, I believe this is the last. But now you're here, trombone. Nary an, un an unruly student around. All the problems are slowly but surely working their way out. In a good spot. Things are looking up. Man. Second to level. Revenge, I suppose. Principal cover for me on Friday. She could barely keep on her seats. Oh. Again! Again. I'm just a second too late. Yeah. The doctor's office is telling me I was like, what? Yeah. You know, I remember that I had a follow up appointment from my structure. I think I've told the story before about my doctor. She drives me crazy. She's very thorough. She's very careful. She is, whenever I whenever I uh, went in for my strep throat and was like telling her about the pain I was having and the soreness and that kind of thing, uh, I have I have particularly gigantic tonsils. And she was like, oh, she was like, with this kind of infection, 
um, some of the like tonsil infection can, can, can land in the back of the throat and it can like lead to the point that the very back of your tonsils gets so infected that you just have to have like a total like throat surgery and you'll have to like speak through one of the tubes that they give uh, smokers to speak. And I was like, that just feels really exciting. I feel like I feel like you're catastrophizing this really just mild thing. But she had one friend during med school that had it. And so thus, every every uh, patient that has any any kind of sign of it has got to have it as well. Yes, that doesn't sound comforting. Indeed. And she's that way with everything. Whenever I told her that I was uh, starting to exercise again, and I was trying to be more regular about um, stretching and going on walks, she was like, that's great. Have you tried walking with um, dumbbells? And I was like, just celebrate this victory with me. Just be with me for this one victory. Let me know that, that this is a good job, that I've done a good job. Pat me on the back. Don't tell me to carry dumbbells. All right, let's... You just start carrying 35-pound dumbbells. Right. And be like, yeah, I'm overdoing <laughs> it. Like, that, in that increased my anxiety just hearing that. Right? Right? Especially whenever you're not feeling good. And then you hear them tell, like, this is, this is how this could go so much worse. Let's bump the CPUs up. Hard comms. Now we get to watch... Now we get to watch me lose even more. Didn't mean to do that one again, but here we are. It's a good one. Ooh, ho, ho, ho. But yeah, she's a very good doctor. Wow. What are the odds? 33%, I suppose. Um... She's a good doctor, but she is a uh, worry wart. I appreciate her thoroughness. She's internal medicine, and that's probably the main reason. We go there for my wife. All well, for autoimmune stuff. Let's see. Three reasons that I don't want to be a teacher. Oof. Uh, let's see. My number one reason is uh, vomit, actually. That is my biggest reason. I don't know what it is about children. Children children just vomit. They just do. And I just emotionally can't do it. I can't. Cannot do it. I, have, I cannot tell you the last time I've seen vomit that is not my own child's. And uh, that's how I like my life. So that's my top, that's my top reason. My second reason would be um, the bureaucracy of the establishment of the school. Uh, I have no interest in participating in school government, school boards, school principal situation, dynamics between grades. All that stuff sounds very stressful to me. Uh, and uh, the number three reason is because I'm in North Carolina. And we are notoriously uh, rotten. Those might have been too real. Are those too real? Do I need to give more goofy answers? My reason is I would just be too good at it. The kids would I'd be, be too, too smart for their own good. I would be so frustrated by... These kids don't know anything. If the bureaucracy is real, yeah. Yeah. I won't weigh in on that any more than I do. <laughs> North Carolina is better than Arizona. Well, we're probably where the two of us are riding along the bottom, my my friend. I have heard that there's anything wrong. Oopsie. Thought I still had my star. Thought I still had my star, didn't I? Sorry, Pineapple. You were, it was just, you were such an easy target, my friend. I feel guilty. I feel really bad, but you were just there, man. You were there. What could I have done? The Discord chat is so much faster than the stream, so I hear, I'm sorry, and I tear it immediately and see you throw a <laughs> green shell at him at, like, point-blank range as it's you're both cruel. wading through the sand. It was really cruel. <laughs> you're very, you're very kind, Pineapple. I'm going to check pay rankings. I don't even necessarily mean there. But that is definitely one aspect. 
I, don't know, I can't I can't give them too hard of a time because it ain't like preachers get much more. We're pretty neck and neck. Preacher teacher family. The classic preacher teacher. Don't know what it is about teachers that keep marrying preachers. Considering I voted for this course, I'm doing pretty poorly. Pay right next to each other for North Carolina and Arizona in the upper 40s, which isn't good. Out of the it's pretty bad. Well, it makes it that much worse when you consider how much they have to do. This game is trying to let me catch up with y'all. Giving me every mushroom I could ask. God, oh, I was so close. I was so close. I'm oh, sorry, I'm so sorry. That was a real <laughs> mess of an ending to that. I went from first to seventh in like three seconds. That was rough. That was rough. I didn't help things. You're still holding strong. Holding strong in third. You're in that top three. All right, let's see. For Splash. For Splash, we're going to do Waluigi Pinball. Wow, you picked the same one. Oh, well. Nope. The uh, Rando does not like Splash. Sorry, Splash. RNG was not on your side. I actually hate this course. Load it and back. Now, while I will say that the, uh, the teacher's pay is pretty abysmal, I do recall that substitute teaching pay pretty well for what it was worth. But not if you're having as many stressful situations as you are. Oh, I don't know, are you subbing? Are you technically subbing or are you doing something like You're no longer subbing. You were at the beginning. But now you're, now you're, you're in the hole. You're in the position. I guess guaranteed hours. But... I went through all of the substitute teaching, training. I did all the jazz, all the stuff. And then I wound up getting my first job as uh, my first deployment. Literally, literally the second I finished my, my sub teaching training, I got the surprise call. Told my admin they needed to go back and ask about me being full time because they're having me do essentially full time work. I want me to attend meetings after school, but I don't have the hours for that. Unpaid work I'm going to do, which isn't okay, and that's exactly what I'm doing. I wish you luck. I hope they respect that. They should, they ought to. Never work for okay. 
Unfortunately, that's the name of the game. Isn't it? For the children. Cynical nightmare. I think it's because of. Uh, I think it's because we started with a hot take. I think it's because we started with hot take. If we hadn't started with the 56 game hot take, then I might not be as uh, as cynical as I am. And then, and then my cynicism mode. That was the first time I'd ever gotten a lightning. I don't think in my entire playthrough of Mario Kart, in my entire existence of life, I've gotten a lightning. It's gross that it's so expected. Agreed. No, no, whoopsie. No, 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 don't leave the group. All right, well, I hope I'm, I hope it doesn't get selected. I'm so sorry if it does. I didn't go far enough. I tried to. This is why I asked what meetings, PD trainings I was supposed to attend. I was told a bunch were mandatory, and I haven't gone because I don't have the hours for it. You go, Glen Coco. Final race. Whoopsie. <laughs> Hit the wrong button. Pineapple bumped me right out of the way. Let's pay that. Pay that for earlier, I'm sure. He hadn't forgotten that green shell. He's gonna get his revenge. Yikes! I had such a good combo lined up. And just got wrecked. It felt cool for a moment. I was, like, doing, I was doing all these good moves, good combos. Ah, so close. Oopsie, you're on there. Yikes! Who took my shells? Someone has come over to say hello. Is that in the chat or is it in the room? Either way, okay. Again, that was the second time I've had like the perfect combo lineup and then just got racked, dude. Fifth place ain't bad. Folks, don't forget about the racing Gamba if you're wanting to earn some channel points. Oh, didn't I get a Gamba earlier from the uh, Gotcha oh, yeah, that I did. missed that? Would you like it to be a race Gamba? 
to use it, sure. or would you rather just uh, okay? I don't care. Let's do it. We're gonna keep hard comms on because that was that was fun and challenging. I thought. Okay, the gamba shall be. Will. NPN. Finish in top three. And it's just the next race, not the whole tourney. I'll put two minutes on the clock. Mm, that's too long. One minute. Moink. And I will pick. I'll pick this one. So bet your gambas, folks. Oh, we got a gotchapon from Trombone. I'll have to add you to the list. The gotchapon's empty. Who would have done that? Watch Trombone. Trombone's gonna get another one. Gonna get another uh, Gotcha King. And, uh, all these people swooping in. Swooping in on the Gotcha King title. Wow. The last I just saw was 2k versus 2k points. People are betting. That either shows a lot of confidence or a real act. Does anybody in the chat say both with the L? Do I have any both saves? I know we have people that, that range the whole gamut of uh, regional dialect. Oh, nice shot, by it. Threw that banana forward right as I was getting the boost to do that jump. That was impeccable aim. Somebody can go in and enjoy my green shell. Whoops. Oh dear. Oh, yikes. I think I know. I think I know where I'm going to end up. I'm not going to call it yet. I'm still going to try my darndest. I'm going to give it my all. Stranger things have happened. Had the shield of bananas! The whole shield! I didn't notice Trombo. I clearly have not noticed several bananas. Final lap. Will I be able to climb six places? Again, I say, stranger things. Nope. right at it, man! <laughs> Come on! Yeah, there ain't no chance. Congratulations. Congratulations to the winners. I lose, you win. So there you go. So anytime you want to pull a Gamba, it only costs 100 points per race. Win big.
How's everybody feeling at the midweek mark? Trying to get back to my DS days, pulling all the DS ones. The DS was a great, was a great Mario Kart. Hopefully everybody's feeling good about their midweek. Entering into a midweek high and not a midweek blues. Exhausted, looking forward to some vacation next week. That sounds really nice. We are, we are at the precipice of moving some day. Maybe number two has really done a number on us. I honestly feel like four to five months is more tiring than moving. did a uh, hospital visit today and helped out a lady who was uh, trying to fill out paperwork by holding their 11 month baby and so now baby number three is back in the conversation mm -hmm. tell ya it has never been a consideration for me that is, that is the, the number that shall not be named always knew I wanted to and was just satisfied with that one. Yeah, that was a funny uh, kind of comparison of our day. She's like, I got to hold this little baby, and I'm just, just thinking a lot about number three. I was like, that's cool. I had to pick up both of our kids up from preschool, and Benjamin wanted to ride on the back of the stroller, and Helen didn't want him to, so she kicked me in the ankle. So I'm pretty good at two. <laughs> yeah, I just that's really the trick is like all you really have to do is make sure you don't both line up at the same time as long as one of you is all always a little exhausted and one of you is in baby fever you're, you're in a good spot that's where the matter is I feel kind of bad that I, I like bumped you into that blue shell okay. going fast the way it goes. Mm -hmm. Robin's racing. And pineapple stole my double, my double block. Yeah. at that point you were first oh i guess so people had already finished i didn't know that is that i'm gonna do chase me after i've already been done with the race for 30 seconds trombone you got the you got the cheeky thumbs up Gotcha waiting to be restocked. It is waiting to be restocked. I'll have to write your name down. Don't let me forget. Next time we're in between races, remind me so I write your name down. Handy, handy. After seeing my three step siblings have a total of 11 kids, more than two kids was never an option. Explain to me this math for just a moment. 11 kids between three step siblings. How many does that mean to these shots? I feel like I'm, I'm doing that same thing.
If sneaky so there's something poetic something. about hearing Cat Peach going meow, 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 as you just barely pass me and you careening into a truck. <laughs> I love Cat Peach. She's great. She provides for humor, whether a good person is playing her or whether somebody that gets, uh, runs the truck. One has five kids, the other two have three each. Wow. I have some cousins that have six. And, uh, not, not for me. When they started at the beginning, they were going to do all E names. And then eventually they just they kind of gave up and started doing what at least sounds like an E. They did a lot of I names. It's it's kind of antiquated. Has... It's kind of an old an old thing. We used to do that. Families used to be that. My brother has three girls, and all of their names end with uh. So it's Olivia, Emma, and Ava. And so when we had Helen, I was like, the only thing I ask is that we don't end with an A. <laughs> I like ending with the same thing rather than starting with the same. Thing. Well, actually, I think the only one that I would like is uh, like I don't think I would like uh, then. Like, I wouldn't like if it was, like, Caden, Braden, Layton. That would not be for me. But all three of them ending in the not bad. Two-ish. Two-ish. I can't race with Ouija in my hand. Then put Ouija on your face. He could be my... He could be, uh... My second you, are you pulling him out of the gacha pond? Oh, that's true. It did look like he was in there, didn't it? All right. Ninji, hello. Need time. Got to pick a race. Uh, let's do. Let's do chocolate. Oh, and locks. Now I got to be the three-headed beast here. Cerberus. Just trying to see how many puppets we can get you to stop in your shirt. It's actually been a little while since we've redeemed a puppet. Okay. These are me and my children. Don't talk to me or my sons ever again. Lonk is not doing well. It's actually it's actually hurting my shoulders to hold them up to my face like this. Zeltar will have to wait until I'm done with the race. I simply cannot do it. I see you, I hear you, I respect you. I cannot do it. It is feasibly impossible. I have to raise my shoulders to keep them going. Honestly, it'd be better if they were on my hands. This point. Why do I have to raise my shoulders? I'm gonna try not to. Okay. I'm not raising my shoulders now. Ouija, you know you're you're pretty infamous for this game. You're known for your dirty looks. Yeah, I know. I'm still getting royalty checks. You're getting royalties exclusively on um, on your dirty looks that you give to other people. Working on those traps. With me. This is what my doctor wants me to do. She would tell me to make sure I'm, I'm also working out my belt while working out. Make sure. Don't forget to also put tiny little weights on your um, eye eyelids. So as you open your eyes and close your eyes. Open your eyes. As Brian Regan said, I would believe except after. I would believe except after C and it sounded like A as in neighbors away and it sounded. And on weekends and holidays all throughout May, and you'll be wrong no matter what you say. Pull that one out of the deep recesses of my brain. Back in my days where I thought I was going to be a comedian, I religiously studied stand up comics. Brian Reed was one of the guys. 
really close to that. What's up, Stain? How we doing, my friend? All right, they're falling. They're falling. They're gone. <clears throat> that had to have been around five minutes. Now Zeltar will join me for the last race. That was the last race. Well, the last. Oh. I guess so. We still have an hour and a half of races. Definitely not the last race. The next race. Stained, how's your Wednesday treating you? How's that midweek? Midweek going. Reverse, reverse. Easy. Easy. Okay, Google, set a five minute timer. And glasses, and I'm in cozy mode. Sure. That adds up. You guys are just burning channel points. Nobody's wanting that that VIP slot, I guess. Nobody wants to join poor lonely sneaky and splash. Can't remember who else is out there. Stained I'm a I absolutely cannot read your message. Perry, can't read your message. I only know it's you because of your name color. If somebody else joined the chat and had your name color, then I don't know if it's you even speaking. Okay. Controller's upside down. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yep. We're managing. No, no drifting. No drifting this time because I cannot possibly control the speed with which I will drift. Let's see if I can do a jump. Nope. Nope. Wrong way. Up. That adds up. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, we're fine. We're fine. We got this slow and steady. Slow and steady. Just you know, watch your watch your six. Try not to run off the track too many times. Get coins where you can. Try and if you could, it would be it would be great if you could jump. Holding strong at night. Holding strong. Oh, here comes the, here comes the door. Thank you. Yeah, go up, uh, other way. Maria, I know you're judging me. Maria, are you excited for Chris Pratt to officially voice you? We get to hear your voice very soon. It's me, Mario. Hey guys, it's me, Mario. It's me, I'm Mario. I sound like everyone ever. I did just recently watch rewatch the uh, Lego movie with the kids. And so good. It was, it was fine. Yeah. That was one of my favorites for a while. But not even really because of Emmett. I mean, Chris Pratt does a good job. A good job with the role. But I just love, I love the, uh, the jokes and uh, mm -hmm. the goofs and the gaps. Chris Miller and Lloyd. Lloyd, that's his name. Chris Miller, I know. Or maybe it's not Chris Miller. Maybe it's the other Whatever they do. They're very good. You know what? I didn't finish in 12th without my glasses and the controller upside down. I think that's worth 40 points. So just add 40 points to whatever score I have at the end. That's only fair. Still have no idea what anyone is saying. Not a single clue. Oh, Marie fell. Oh no! Get down I go! Oops, no. Do not leave the group. It's very important that I do not do that. Um, okay, I'm going to try to lean in and read some messages. 
how Stain wants to jump in. I think he... Can he join in the middle of a set? I don't think you can join in the middle of a set, but we can always just close it out. Stain said, not bad. Little son has been trying to flex on his friends about his non-existent YouTube channel. Trying to drop in points like they're hot. Stain says, so no, he has a YouTube Minecraft channel. Perry says, oh no. This is well. Someone says, I can't join the VIP club because I have a sword. That's why I'm wrapping up. Can I jump in? Stain, I, I, I think we can just quit the next round. Oh no. Oh no, Marie! I don't think we can stop, but I, I don't know. Can we just stop attorney? Or do we have to close out the group and start like Well, these Mario Kart attorneys are very serious on stream, so I think we need to play them all the way through. Save Marie. I can't. One minute's up anyway. One minute's up. Controller back around. Glasses on. Get on the floor. Okay. Okay. Still managed to be in seven. Oh, okay. 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 Here. I'm trying to like now read through messages. Would be a crazy flex if his YouTube outpaces all our church channels, right? That's the thing about YouTube, dude. All about the niche. All about the niche and the timing and the SEO and the audience that finds it. Chat that happens. Ah -ha. What's up, base man? We're trying to catch up. Oh, come on. All I want to do, all I want to do is read the messages. Which man, how's your Wednesday treating you? Go for it, Stained. Save Marie, Ao. Oh, Captions just said something about drugs. I am concerned. Well, it would only be to avoid them. Unless they are medically prescribed. Nothing worse than that timing. It's like all the computer players hold on to their power-ups until you're in the last stretch, and then they just <laughs> hit you all at once. That was rough. That was a rough one. That was a rough one. Rough go. All right, stained. We're gonna we're gonna back out, even if we have to leave the group. Well, that's gonna erase your forty points that you had. Oh no, I have them. They're forty-seven points. So I won. I won this one. I got one. I got first place this time. Just imagine that I have the crown. All right, I will start back up another group, and Stain can join in. Capiche? I'm gonna change to the Vespa. I'm feeling Vespa. H-Man, I actually just heard about you today. I was listening to uh, Deacon Havoc and Circuit Rider on the Pastoring in the Digital Parish podcast, which I'm going to share on our Discord tomorrow because it's great. Good stuff. And I learned, it turns out, that you're a gamer. That was the name drop. Havoc said, my husband is a bit of a gamer. And now the world knows. No hiding it anymore. H-Man is a gamer. I know. Believe me. No one was as shocked as I was. 
Stained, if you're still here, join in, my friend. Mine friend. I think we're friends. Aren't we friends? I'm gonna go out on a limb. Are we not friends? I'll be on the lookout for your friend request then. I thought we were friends. Maybe you're friends with uh, Checkpoint Church. Next you're gonna tell me he plays Magic the Gathering or LOL? Impossible. I hear he doesn't even like League that much. No joke, this is like the first time I've logged into my Switch in a long time. Me because too. of uh, because of the Steam Deck. Mm -hmm. Until they come out with a Nintendo game that I want to play, which is regularly, but it just hasn't happened for a little bit. Once they come out with a, a Nintendo game, I'm going to play the heck out of it. And then I'm going to go back to the Steam Deck. It really is an exceptional machine. Weirdly enough, I've been playing Nintendo games on my Stream Deck. Oh, have you really? Uh, just the Super Metroid Mario, or the Super Metroid Zelda randomizer. I haven't downloaded any emulators on it. I've just been using Steam. I didn't even set up the Game Pass thing. I'm fine. I'm fine playing Game Pass games on my phone. Has Stain disappeared? I think so. <clears throat> it was all a trick to make you lose your 40 points. I didn't lose them. I won that round. I'm not seeing any proof of it here. I don't think we can do just one race. So we can't even just do a race while we're waiting for Stained. Stained, I will give you precisely 15 seconds to at least let us know that you're like working on it. You're booting up the Switch. You're crafting your Switch right now. Maybe he left because you called him out for being a gamer. It's possible. Well, I actually called out H-Man. Oh. But Stained is also a gamer. Maybe, maybe it was, um, maybe he's helping with the Minecraft YouTube channel. Splash was here for just a minute. A while ago. All right, stay in five, four, three, two, one. We're going for it. Another one. Whoopsie. The nerd pastor mate was making fun of 50 year olds earlier. I was. I was mean. Thane's 84. That's true. Not 50. Oops. No, do not like the roots. I didn't mean to be so mean. The old man joke will draw him back. <laughs> He'll just be summoned. Summoned by the old man joke. I've been on the best one. Majek. We wish we need him. We should have that Majek emote ready. So close. Oh, ah! and then I fall. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Yeah. 
No. Oh, I thought my top was gonna kill It's so close. Saw there's gonna be a speaking of stain, there's gonna be a stained glass artist at LTN Con. And I thought about commissioning a checkpoint church piece of stained glass, and that'd be super cool. Be pretty rad. Yes, says Trombo. I think it'd be cool too. Oh. Didn't mean to fit like the same stage again, and now it's definitely going to be paint. <laughs> it's, it's totally going to be the one. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Hilarious. So, did anyone else see the Wiglet Pokemon announcement today? I did indeed. I think he's very cute. I do not care for his name. Kind of sad you can't change controls. What do you mean, Pineapple? Oh, it's not gotcha. Yeah, it is weird. It is weird. Isn't it? So I saw they're based off of like the little garden eels. And that makes it a little less cursed. It made it cute once I saw that. I have not seen, but I'm now intrigued. Oh, you gotta look on the front one. Maybe. Another reason to be excited about Violet and Scarlet. Some of the non-family friendly uh, discords I'm in had a field day with uh, the new yeah. Wiglet. Yeah, it, really an unfortunate name choice. I think they probably should have probably should have looked at it just one more. There's just, there's really oh, just two main just jumped on us. Finally on his way. Oh, I am friends. I, I was looking for Stain. I wasn't looking for Stain. I knew. Man, I am not doing very well this time. Chair called me literally as I started to log on. Ugh. That's all good. We'll just wrap it up on a we'll wrap it up on a strong first place. So that you can join in next round. And Yeah, I feel like oh, the shame of getting two stars in a golden mushroom. The greatest! Gamer! Now, I haven't looked in a while. I wonder if we have room for more emotes. Because I think that they I think that they give you more emotes the more subs that you get. And we technically reached like a pretty ridiculous amount of subs with our subathon. I wonder. Alright, Stain, we start another one. 
you should be able to join now. Unless you have another admin call. You're the chief. Have a trophy. All right. I'm going to take the comms down to normal. Now there's four of us. Um, we'll still we'll still plan to do 150. Should be good to go. Friend has returned. I miss my kitty cat. I miss whenever we had the cat here. Like I was never in this place, but I was whenever I was at my home office. My cat would just join us. I loved that. Samson's the best. Oh. I was curious if Dave or Russ would have seen that I did their 56 game ranking list but I haven't seen them pop in down on the bottom I might just have to wait for the vibe to come out false Minerva is the best I just can't imagine a better cat than Samson until I'm in the he really is the best. Oh, he is his team. He's the one who can do the best team. Give him some. Some more human friends. Vespa. Yeah, the Vespa's not liking this one. Russ about to go live. What's he playing in Is he still playing through uh, Destiny? He's playing last time I knew <laughs> Oh, this is going swell. This is simply going swimming. Though. FIFA. Come on! <laughs> Give me a second. I looked away for half a second. All right. Yeah. FIFA 20. Butter up those wheels. For real. So you're telling me he's playing FIFA 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 22, 22. They keep giving me the, the golden mushroom, and I frankly don't want it. Not on this course. Whoa! Man, two shout outs in one stream crossfire. I'll expect my check in the mail. Hey, I'd like one of those. I'd like one of those. Could I have the bullet bill, please? I think I'm having a worse a worse run than anyone. Could I have a bullet bill? I've gotten hit by two blue shells. I think I'm having a considerably worse than you. No way. You can ask anyone in the chat. You have not had a worse time than me. Even being hit by two blue shells, I have had a worse time than anyone has ever had on this course. Before. I'm to the point where I'm going to stop hitting the A button. Because honestly, I could I could just slide downhill to my destination with how slick these wheels are. Legit 12th place. Can't even tell you the last time I got 12th place. Oof. I still love the Vespa. Nothing but love. I feel like the new courses come out before too long. 
Haven't they been announced, or am I wrong? Am I misremembering? No, they have not. The ones that we're playing now are the ones that were announced most recently. So I think I found our raid for tonight, then. Is it is it uh, Crossfire? Or is it somebody new? Good. Hey, it wasn't that obvious. It was mostly obvious. But I also thought you could have just been telling me that you met a new, a new excellent, wonderful streamer that you wanted to see. Yeah, I haven't been able to spend time with my regular streamers, let alone find more. I never know. T-Bone has ways. T-Bone has mysterious ways. T-Bone works in mysterious ways. Yeah, don't use me for your blasphemy. <laughs> You're saying you can't work in mysterious ways. Metfest. Hashtag Metfest. You don't work in mysterious ways. I didn't say your ways were more mysterious. I think God's ways are more mysterious than mine. Yours can still be mysterious. person that might have more mysterious ways. Man, second place. Oof, it hurts. Now you're being as pedantic as my students. If your students are that clever, you know, they're clever. I feel much better about my score that time than about the last one. The Electrodome. Ooh, Baby Park. We have officially played all the new maps. Bats said I said I should have my intro music ready for his channel tonight. Rock on. What song did you choose? I'm pretty happy with my uh, Pokemon battle music. Got to split a bit early, but y'all enjoy the rest of the racing. See you, Perry. Thanks for tuning in, my friend. Have a good night. Hopefully all is well at the Perspective household. And I'm sleeping soundly. Get some rest. We'll catch you in the morning, hopefully. Then I'm finishing up one shot. Something appropriate for me. Does that mean it's going to be something Dr. Fuji? Or something fun? Is it Careless Whisper, but exclusively played in trombone? Have you played that new trombone master game? I have not, but I'm so tempted. Trombone champ? Very tempted. I'm just worried the gimmick is going to be real short. I'm not sure if it's real. Cool. It cool it
Yeah. That being said, I have no idea. It's like 15 bucks, I think. I'm just not sure it's worth the memes. It may be. You do want to play it. I do want to point out that you did not confirm or deny that it was Chaos Whisper Code on Thunder. Should have done it. Should have saved it. Or is it the Doctor Who theme code on Thunder? That would also be good. Did I not confirm? Hey -o! Wow! Finishing strong, dude! You did not confirm or deny that it was Careless Whisper on the trombone. You're welcome to use that rendition, too. Got sniped out of first. By who? By who? Say more. Mount Mario. I like this one. You recall what was your what was your wrinkle brain riddle that you got? I don't remember mine, so I'm I'm asking something that you may know. I certainly don't remember. Mine. No, I do remember mine. I think mine was a shirt. I think the answer to mine was a shirt. word which can be written on the board. Ah. I even think I was there because I recall your answer. Do recall it was uh, Megan from Drake and Josh's favorite insult. Precise with those fireballs, dude. Stain wasn't playing any game. Man. Stain was gonna get those fireballs on that one particular, that poor baby. I think it was baby Rosalina. Still won by one point. Woof. That's a close one. Can't believe I pulled out third. Wow. Pretty good for me. All right. I gotta call tonight. 
Thanks for playing, guys. All right, all good, Zando. Deuces. Deuces, deuces. Folks, I'm planning on playing until 10. I'm here till 10, so if you guys want to keep going, you feel free to stay in. If you got to hop out, you got to hop out. But do let me know before we queue up another one. Stained and Pineapple, if you're good to go, then we'll keep going. If you got ahead, then go ahead and head out now, and we'll start up a queue with whoever's left. And if nobody's left, then I'll play on uh, the intranets. I'll give you, like, I don't know, a couple seconds to just give me a thumbs up. Still here, says Pineapple. Stain, still here? Stain's just starting. Stain's just getting started. I imagine. Nice. Let's do it. All right, we'll go for the same thing. Normal comms, no teams, 150. I didn't realize you were streaming for another hour. Yep, we're streaming till 10. 7 to 10 now. We were doing 6 to 9, but uh, the only issue with 6 to 9 was that uh, 6 o'clock is way too early whenever you have Vivis. So now we're doing 7 to 10 again. We're back to the old schedule. But you are certainly all good to do a stream jump. If you aren't able to return, it is okay. Don't sweat it. We appreciate you being here when you're able to be here. Yeah, we'll be going until 10, and then tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock we'll be playing one shot, hopefully finishing it up. We'll see. Maybe another bonus stream on Friday. That's what I'm trying to do. If I have an open Friday, if I don't have any meetings or anything, I'm going to try and knock out some bonus streams, try and get these bonus streams out of the way, because I am, I am just stopped with bonus streams. I've got to do something. That is a that is a potential game plan as long as it works. Things are going else on a Friday. I don't know if I'm there are probably things that I should be working on, like nailing off all of the meaning uh, shirt. I really thought I was going to be able to make the jump. Nope. I had hope that I could make the jump. But I couldn't, couldn't make a jump. And I had peace until I got decked by three people in a row. I had no hope resting in space because I fell off the edge. Man, I was going to cut it. I was going to cut the corner perfectly. It bumped me. Usual. I was so scared of Bullet Bill. So scared of Bullet Bill. Don't give this to me! Don't! I hate the golden mushroom! Give me the bullet bill! All I have to do is get better than 12. All I have to do is get better than 12. Just don't give me 12 again. I did. Why did I use it? Why did I use it? Why would I have done such a thing? What would have compelled me to have used the mushroom? The world in Hold strong. Hold strong in eight. I don't, I don't want better than eighth. I don't need better than eight. I'm just fine with eighth place. Seventh place is fine. I'll take seventh. But I don't need it. I'm fine with eighth. I'm fine with anything down to eleventh right now. Right? As long as I don't get twelfth again, that's really that's that's my main that's my prerogative. As it is. Just don't get twelfth. Beautiful. 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 Wow. Wow, I do not like that course. Not with the Vespa.
still want that Electrodome. I'm voting for it on the regs. My first was not deserved. You didn't earn it? I don't believe you. You earned it. You're worthy. You are worthy to wear the crown. <laughs> Has anybody watched the newest episode of Andor? I have yet to catch it. I got, I'm not going to lie. I'm not real interested in catching it. I'm somewhat hopeful because now I feel like we're actually getting into the story. Now that now that Scar's guard is in it. Maybe now we'll actually get some right, right proper storytelling. What right proper? Either we're about to get right proper storytelling or we're about to get a bunch of cameos from in the universe. Like Andor is gonna be gonna be like chilling on some random planet with Scar's Guard and then out of nowhere you can see like Obi-Wan in the background talking with the cafe diner guy from uh, the second one. And you're like, what? This is amazing. Apparently, apparently, I was on like television before. Apparently, um, what's his name? Diego Luna specifically requested that this show be light and fast. Which, for what it's worth, means very different things to an anime viewer. And I was very confused when I first read that. And I, didn't like that. I feel like I feel like people need to be aware. Those are very different things. They have been real generous with blue shells for my friend Pineapple and red shells for me. They have just been right generous with them. Never seen so many red shells and so many blue shells in one race. But I do say so myself. Once again, voting for the Electrodome. Turn up my opacity just a little further. Yeah, that's better. And I guess an episode of She-Hulk also came out today, didn't it? Last episode left a pretty rotten taste in my mouth. And that was kind of the point. I saw somebody get real mad about it. About the fact that they were like, that was the whole point of the episode. She mentions at the beginning that this is going to be a random, a random stray in the middle of the season. Couldn't be worse timing. I agree. I was like, well, just because they write that in there, they can My, my review currently on Serialized, which is, of course, my journaling for TV shows that I have. I have too many journaling. My critique of it, my, my critique of She-Hulk so far 
is that I don't think there has been a single show in existence that has needed the writing of Mindy Kaling so badly. I don't know what they were thinking, not hiring Mindy, because if you watched the Mindy Project, which not many people did, but if you did, that show was funny. It was really, really good. It was very well written. I know people have mixed feelings about Mindy Kaling, but that show was excellent. And that's what She-Hulk humor should be. And it ain't. I don't care what people say. The humor's fine, but it is not excellent. I think Mindy could have pulled off this. Maybe my hot tail. I think. The actors that play She-Hulk is so good, phenomenal. They really have a great cast. I really think where their where their weak is there. Pulled it off just in time. We did just do the electric gun. the airport next. Love the airport. Big fan. I wish I did know how much was left in one shot because I would say I need to plan what game I'm going to play after it. I've got so many games in the backlog in the hopper. As someone that is not very familiar with um, weaponry, are there any other forms of artillery that are kept in a pot? Or is it exclusively paintball? Because paintball is the only one that I know, but that doesn't mean that it's the only one. But I remember thinking that was so cool. You kept little paintballs in this little canister. In the I also remember being shot with that thing going on. I'm in first? Uh-oh. I didn't even realize. I didn't even realize I was in first. Oh, look at us. The three amigos up here. First, second, third. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? That's really swell. Yeah. 
man. I thought three red shells. Maybe I could slow you down right at the front, pineapple, but I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I tried so hard. Thought for sure I had it. Had it in the bag. I did not. So it's been really interesting. I feel like I'm living uh, Stain's life from last year right now. Just one day a week instead of every day a week. But I am taking Nora to dance classes on Wednesday. And they don't let us inside. We can't like go into the waiting area or whatever anymore because of COVID. And then they just kind of kept it because they liked people not hanging out in the waiting room. And so I just hang out in my car for like an hour during dance. And I just get work done. I just get stuff done. I've written a sermon now, like two weeks in a row. Uh, whenever I've got all my notes and things, I've already done all the exegetical stuff, just like putting pen to paper and getting it done. Boom. Happens. I'm in the zone. I'm in the flow. I got the window down. The fresh air coming in. Coolio died? Oh my goodness. An icon. They say. The Topher again. The Topher nonsense has got to stop. said Thunderbolt. Wow. Wow, man. That was close. I feel like we just barely, we just barely made that one work. I wonder if we got time for another tourney after this tourney, because I think this is the first race of this tourney. I have time for Unamas. Unamas. Yeah, look at that crown, dude! It's not often we see NPN with the crown. That is a rarity. A positive rarity. I still am painfully curious. Hmm. Yes. I love this course. Even though I think some of my worst races have happened in this course. I don't know if it's a 
points. I'll take a green shell. I don't. It doesn't have to be a red shell or anything. I'll take a green. I just need. I need something to protect myself with. They can't keep getting away with this. Yes, I'll take it. Happily take it. I knew that was gonna happen. Oh. Good news is I dodged the blue. He's almost a twofer. Very close to a twofer. I can do about that. Get those fireballs out of here! Who just plays all those fireballs, dude? Who was that? <laughs> That was the stained glass method if I've ever seen it, but I think it was pineapple. Pineapple was directly behind me. It was you. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it, man. That was all Stain's method. I saw him use it successfully just moments prior. I love that course. Let's see if we can crash the stream. That's what always happens when we do Excite Bike. Ah, oh, the clock. The tick tocking clock. Pushed me the wrong way. <laughs> I knocked you down, but I only hurt myself. Those are the alternate lyrics to the uh, jump around. Boost off of this car. I guess I know. And a lightning at the exact time of a blue shell. I can! I totally can. I just got the timing.
go down. Nope. Man, am I about to get a perf on you guys? 45? What's happening? What is happening? Everything's coming up aces, dude. Is it Chubba Sings tub thumping. Am I losing my marbles? Ooh, Chocolate Mountain. I don't know this one very well, so it is pretty likely that I will not do so hot. But maybe. I'd like that perfect 60. That sounds nice. No, not a coin! Why? Why is it cursing me with these coins? I get something to protect myself with every time. Pineapple. Are you going to keep me from my perfect 60 right now? You've got the blue shell killer in your hands. Means there's nothing. Oh, you just wasted You sold. Why would you do such a thing? Did you give me the dub? Did you give me the dub, Pineapple? That's too kind. Perfect 60, dude. You ran into the wall? Ugh. Okay, I'm out. Last one for Stained. All right, I got one more. I think I got one more round in me. We got 21 minutes till the end of stream. I think that's enough time for one more turn. But all good, Stain. Thanks for joining us tonight, my friend. Appreciate you. Always good to play games with you. I'll give you a memento to back out. GG's. GG's. There he goes. All right, Pineapple, me and you, one more go. I'm going to bump it back up to Hardcom for us. We're going to go for it. Go for it! This will be our last tourney of four races, and then after this, we'll call it a night. 
This has been great. I always enjoy these Game Together streams. Folks, we, we do these every other Wednesday. So the next one will be, let's see, October 12th, maybe? That sounds right. That sounds vaguely correct. Yeah, October 12th will be our next one of these. If you want to help us decide what games to play, be sure to join our Discord. Which is on our link tree if you're watching the VOD, or it'll be linked down below in the description. If you're on YouTube. Or you can just type in link tree. Link.tree slash And all that information. Now why would I not have used that? Those screams in the background did not sound like screams. They were like screams of sheer terror. You joking? You hadn't had that green shell pineapple. Would have had ya. Would have had ya. Narrowly, narrowly evaded the final strike. But yes, if you want to be a part of the conversation on what games we play on these Game Together weeks, you need to join the Discord. We have conversations about what we want to play. What, what are we feeling? What's going down? Hey, how about that, pineapple? Crazy odds. <sighs> For instance, today was either going to be um, Mario Kart 8, which was obviously chosen, or Pokemon Unite was on the table, or people can always make recommendations. This is so much different than the DS version. Yeah, it's pretty different. But I like it. I have I have grown to really, really like it. Like, I understand why they won't make it. I don't know when Mario Kart 9 is actually coming. I don't know if it ever will. Well, I have really good. It has quickly become probably my favorite party.
so many bombs. Oh my goodness. That was insane. Yeah? Yes! <laughs> nice, dude. Feels good, man. What am I going to do about all these puppets on the ground, you guys? There's so many puppets on the ground. All right, I'm back. What's up, H-Man? Welcome back for the home stretch. Dos mas. Dos mas. Did you miss our entire fun ribbing about how you were a gamer, H-Man? When did you leave? Yup. I was saying I listened to uh, Deacon Havoc and Circuit Rider on Past Winning Ninja Heroes podcast. And uh, yeah, I, heard you, I heard you had a name drop. And uh, Havoc happened to reveal that you are a, you're a big old gamer. Revealed your secret to the world. Now everyone knows. No longer keep it hidden. Everyone knows you're getting the fish. As the whole world listens to the casting of the It's not a specific game event. People will now know you're a nerd. It's official. You can no longer avoid it. Havoc revealed your dirty secret. He did not. I don't think she did mention me. Literally, your your name came up in conversation because you helped her set up their gaming setup. Yeah, yeah, My husband is actually a great example of what we're trying to avoid at Methodist Gaming. We're trying to uh, we're trying to be a safe space in toxic communities online. Like Please a safe space. A safe base to be toxic. Very safe for the cyber boys. Cyber boys feel very secure. my dad that's just a cell phone all right the last one it's the final race now no more races this is the last one no more this is the last race last race The odds were a hundred percent. It's been, I actually think you'd be proud of me. So we ranked the 56 games that Crossfire Faith and Gaming uh, listed as must play games. League was on there, which first off, you need to go pat them on the back because wow. Uh, and also I didn't put it at the end of the list. I didn't rank it at the absolute bottom. 
It was like probably right at the like 60%. Nowhere near as low as I would have anticipated. Like, you'd ask. You can't deny the quality of the experience and the king of moments. What was number one? I believe it was Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley followed by Life is Strange. I got words for Dave and Russ, though, because there was nary a, a single monster catcher game. I can understand people that don't like Pokemon. I get if you don't like Pokemon. But there's got to be, if you're going to include a game that is, if you're going to include a list of games that is meant to be comprehensive of all play styles, but you don't have a monster catcher, oh, yeah. you need to have a monster catcher. It can be Monster Hunter Ball. Not a single monster that can be in There was also no visual novel, but some people don't even get those games, so I can't do I consider them unquestionable. Dirt. Man. Well, let's see the final scores. Let's see the final tallies. Pineapple came out on top. Man, I thought I held strong, too. I thought I held really strong. Not strong enough. But I got a perfect 60 last round, and I'm going to call that. I'm going to call that a night. Folks, we are Checkpoint Church. We're the church for nerds, geeks, and gamers here on Twitch, Discord, and YouTube. We'd love to have you in all of our internet spaces. So be sure to give us a follow here on Twitch. If you're watching the VOD, uh, be sure to go subscribe to our YouTubes. Uh, be sure to check out our Discord, Xbox Point Discord in the chat or on any of our link trees or any of those sorts of things. Get into it. Ooh, that's probably real loud. Forgot to turn it back down. Um, we believe three things to be true about every single one of you out there. Whether you believe in God or not, whether you go to church or not, whether you hate church, whether you hate God, doesn't change any of these things. Number one, we believe that God loves you. Number two, we love you. We want community with you. That's what we're doing here. And number three, we believe that you, yes, you matter. You are a person of sacred worth. The world is a better place. Why? Because you are in it. So... Thank you to everybody that joined us tonight and played along with us. We'll be doing these Game Together streams every other week. So the next one will be October 12th. If you want to help us decide what game to play, XMH Point Discord. Join that Discord. Um, we're going to go raid probably the Crossfire Peeps, especially since we've given them so many shout-outs tonight. Why not? Why not keep the love going? Playing FIFA 23. Go root on, root on his, his, uh, his soccer tourney there. Uh, and enjoy the rest of your night, folks. I'm going to go catch some Z's, as it were. But I appreciate those of you that were able to join us for this fun stream. If you will, please spam some You Matters in the chat for our good friend Russ, who is streaming for Crossfire Podcast. I'm going to go ahead and start that raid. Folks, again, God loves you. We love you. You matter. Till the next time I see you, whether it's tomorrow morning, 9 o'clock Eastern time for the maybe the end of One Shot. I don't know. We'll find out. We're definitely playing more of it, so I don't know where it's going to go from here. Um, but be sure to join us for that in the morning, and we'll see where we go from there. Until the next time I see you, folks. Bye-bye!